To find the oxidation number for each element in NaHSO4, this is sodium hydrogen sulfate, we'll use these rules here. So the first thing to note is that this whole compound, there's no negative or positive charge after that. That means this is a neutral compound. When we have neutral compounds, the oxidation numbers, they add up to zero. We look at sodium, that's in group one on the periodic table. It'll have a plus one oxidation number. Hydrogen as well, bonded to nonmetals, plus one. It's also in group one on the periodic table. Sulfur, we can't see from our rules here. We have to look at what it's bonded to to figure out its oxidation state. But oxygen, that's minus two, almost always. So we have minus two on each oxygen here. So all of this is gonna add up to zero. So we can just write an equation. One plus one plus, we don't know what the sulfur is, let's call that X. And then minus two multiplied by the four since we have four oxygens, that equals zero. So X plus, we have minus eight, it's plus two, so minus six, that equals zero. Add six to both sides and we get X equals positive six. So the oxidation state on this sulfur in NaHSO4, that's gonna be positive six. So if you add all these numbers up, four times minus two plus six plus one plus one, you line up with zero since NaHSO4 is a neutral compound. This is Dr. B with the oxidation number for each element here in sodium hydrogen sulfate. Thanks for watching.